friends, it's Deborah. Welcome back to the channel. I haven't been to Costco in a few weeks, so I did need some meat and I wanted to get a lot of fresh fruits and veggies. So I got some there. So let me just jump right in and show you what I got. First things first is I needed this toilet paper. Last one really lasted me a long time. I got this Kirkland Premium Margarita. It's just classic lime. I have a taste, it's warm out today and I have a taste for just margarita on the rock so I'll put in my own tequila and then I always like to get these variety packs and they're on sale right now um, I don't remember the price I think $10.99 but as always I will insert the prices down below I love Nusa yogurts and if I don't buy the Trader Joe's kind I do buy Nusa and I like that these are smaller and they were on coupon I think they were $2 off so and I like all the flavors in here um, blueberry, strawberry, rhubarb, and lemon. So I picked up one little 12 pack of that. I picked up some English cucumbers. I love these in my salad and just with some lemon and salt. This is what I picked up for dinner for tonight, just the salmon. We need a ground beef, so I picked up the three pack of the uh, one pound ground beef. And then Bella's, trigger, uh, Bella's chicken tenderloins. Seven pounds for $20. And then I picked up the organic chicken breasts for us. And that's four pounds for $20. Some baby portobello mushrooms, because I have a couple of steaks I want to make. 24 organic eggs. I needed eggs. The bacon that I always get. Some sugar snap peas. I just, I love snacking on these, and this is what we've been giving Bella lately. The rotisserie chicken, of course. Um, I think I'm gonna use this for salads. Driscoll raspberries, they looked really, really good, so I picked up some raspberries. My favorite medley tomatoes, red seedless grapes, those were really good as well. Just like I said, I need to I really need to start eating a lot more fresh items. So I bought a big container of the organic spring mix, just a pineapple. A little bit of these potatoes. I'm trying not to buy potatoes, but my husband still likes them and eats them, so I figured these are perfect for him. And then a bag of lemons, because I love lemon water. And that's it. That's it for my Costco haul. I will insert a picture of my receipt. And like I said, I'll put the prices down below. Thanks so much for watching, and I'll definitely catch you for next month's Costco haul. So my beautiful friends, I am going to incorporate the Trader Joe's haul with the Costco haul because I went on the same day. So enjoy. I didn't pick up too much. I spent like $102. So it looks like a lot, um, but it wasn't, it didn't cost a lot. So let me just show you what I got. So let me just show you what I got here really quick. You know what? I used to always buy Sargento and I didn't think there was a difference. This Mexican blend is so good. It's so it, it's like creamy. I don't know, but it's really good. So try that if you haven't tried it. I've got the Harati cheese, the rotisserie seasoned chicken breast. That's the only thing I purchased for like lunch meat. I got these chicken breast nuggets. These were really good. I really liked those. Organic super sweet corn. Haven't bought that in a while. Some sugar snap peas. I bought these before the ones I purchased at Costco, but the ones at Costco will last a little longer. The spicy hummus dip. This was so good. I think I almost like it better than the jalapeno cilantro. Very, very good. Um, like I said, I'm trying to eat a little bit better. So I bought these high protein veggie burgers to give these a try. I'm really excited. Try those out. I saw this. I thought these were really interesting. The It's just a blend of the green garbanzo beans, red and green lentils with a touch of tomatoes and olive oil. And then I picked up just one of these boxes of blueberry waffles. Never had them before, but I want to definitely give them a try. The sriracha shrimp bowl, these were really good, so we bought another one. Everybody's been talking about this green goddess salad dressing, avocado, green onion, lemon juice, chives, basil, and garlic. So I definitely have to start eating more fresh, more healthy, so I want to give that a try. Shredded hash browns, I typically buy the Simply Potato ones from Walmart, but these are cheaper, so I've been just picking these up from Trader Joe's. And those are pretty much for my husband. 
these breakfast cereal bars these are really good um strawberry and blueberry and then i also got this organic chai bar with almonds cranberries and pumpkin seeds give those a try this time i did get the sprouted bread but i got the sprouted seven grain bread um, my husband loves these corn dippers i need to stay away from this kind of stuff i also got him the baked cheese crunchies cinnamon grams these cookie butters i know this is the bad stuff okay guys these are really good and i like that they're pre-packaged and i think it's it's 240 because there are those little peanut butter cups so but they're pre-packaged you're not going to sit there and eat the whole bag sweet and juicy mango these are my absolute favorite the roasted plantain chips favorite favorite i just got one can of the fat free refried beans one cookie butter i'm gonna try to not open that and save that for my niece my niece mia um chili and lime seasoning blend i really like cucumbers with chili or yeah with like uh like chili and lemon and salt so i'm gonna give this a try and i needed some red pepper flakes i also got these just to try maybe once or twice the toaster coconut pancake mix i've seen a lot of people haul these and they look delicious and if you've been following me you know that i love anything coconut my husband needed some green tea decaf so i got this kind just the trader joe specialty decaf green tea i got him some classic potato chips i liked this low-cal pink lemonade um i like to add a ton of ice serve it over a ton of ice with some fresh lemons really tasty and then i wanted to try this i've seen this as well before and i never picked it up but it's unsweetened green tea it's blueberry and pomegranate i'm thinking my husband and i both will enjoy that and then my favorite favorite grapefruit sparkling water this is my favorite drink of choice right now guys so that is everything for readers joe hall like i said i didn't pick up too much um but I did pick up some of my staples and then a few new things. Thanks so much for watching, guys, and I'll definitely catch you at the next one. Bye. So, friends, many of you have asked for um, me to put the prices in my videos like I do in Costco. Unfortunately, I did not have the time to do that this time, so I thought I'd share the entire receipt with you. So you'll see that I spent a grand total of $102.21 on this trip. I didn't go grocery shopping for about a week and a half because I was pretty stocked up. Um, but I do entertain a lot. I have a ton of nieces that are always overeating. You know, I have family. My mom comes to stay with me about three, four days out of the week. Um, and we're just that house where people are always over. So it, it's fun. Um, it costs a little bit, but it's fun and I wouldn't have it any other way. That's how our house has always been. My door is always open. So anyway, I spent $102.21, and then also I wanted to let you know that I am working on a video where I review some of the new items that are new to me from Trader Joe's and how I've prepared them and served them and let you know my thoughts on them. So I had made a post on YouTube. It was just a YouTube post stating that I was working on this video. It was about two and a half weeks ago, maybe three weeks ago. Um, so I am working on editing that video and I'm going to get that out. That's going to be my next one. And I thought I would just share with you my thoughts through there. Cause I didn't know I'm always doing hauls, but I'm never sharing with you if I really, really like it or not. <laughs> so I thought this would be a nice different way to reach out to you and let you know my thoughts on those items. So anyway, thank you so much for watching. I do appreciate you spending some time with me today. I always love that. If you're just stopping by Please don't forget to hit that red subscribe button. I would love for you to come and join me on my YouTube journey here. I'm always putting hauls up. Um, I do a lot of hauls, but I am going to get back to posting some home decor stuff. Um, I have a couple of collabs coming up. I have some tags coming up. So there's a lot of fun things coming up. So stick around. And if you're not subscribed, like I said, please don't forget to hit that red subscribe button. Hit that notification bell because I am posting three times a week, but it's been kind of off right now. Just I've just had so much going on. Um, so thanks, guys. Thanks for watching. And I'll definitely catch you at the next one.